Hello, WC fans. I'm Jay Big, standing here with the man who will face the WCWC reigning heavyweight champion, one Ryan Taylor tonight, Mike Santiago. What do you have to say about your match with him tonight? <laughs> so, Ryan Taylor, it's been a wild ride, Jay. Uh, lost shoot to kill two out of three falls for the tag titles. Uh, my tag team partner, Bolo, gets injured. Uh, Dr. Cleaver almost tries to end my career, tries to separate my shoulder. Tonight starts the new quarter of 2010. Ryan Taylor, we've met before, your very first match in Dub C. I'll admit it, you got one up on me. But tonight, when it matters the most, I'm going to take your prized possession, the Dub C, Dub C heavyweight title. And don't stare at me like that, because I ain't got no candy for you. Definitely a very fired up Mike Santiago. We're going to see what happens here tonight in Portland. Mike Santiago, formerly one half of the tag team title now. I believe this is his very first crack at the, at the singles title. That is correct, Mr. Souza. Mike Santiago so excited, he almost takes the whole front stage down. And what you have here, yes, this is Santiago's first attempt at winning the WCWC championship. Formerly a light division champion, formerly a tag team champion. If he wins tonight, he could be the second triple crown champion right after his good partner and friend, Aaron Bolo. That's right. And indeed, he will have his hands full with one Mr. Ryan Taylor, the champ tonight, right here in Portland. Mike Santiago is all ready to go. I, I don't think there's been a time where I've seen him more fired up and more excited than tonight in his very first chance at the WCWC Championship. You know what's on his mind is the championship belt. Right. But he's going to have a tall order against Ryan Taylor. Ryan Taylor spent some time in Japan That's right. at the Kayantai Dojo. Takamishinoku runs that. Very devastating wrestler. Not only he's, he's held WCWC gold, he's also held EWF gold as well. That's right. The star pupil of wrestling legend Jesse Hernandez. Forget what you heard about Brandon Gaston. Ryan Taylor is the star pupil. He's the former NWA Heritage Champion. He's worked in Japan in the Kayantai Dojo. He's had several tryouts with World Wrestling Entertainment. And of course, he's the current WCWC Champion. The list of credentials goes on for miles. And tonight, he is led to the ring by Interim General Manager Gentleman George Michael as he defends that title against one Mike Santiago. You know what that means, if Gentleman George Michael is at ringside, controversy follows him wherever he goes, and I'm going on record, it's just, it's, it sounds like a two-on-one, because you know he's not just going to stand there and let the two wrestle. He's going to get involved. Well, that's your opinion, that's your prediction. We'll see if your prediction is correct, Mr. Souza. Right now, Ryan Taylor and gentleman George Michael representing the faction looking very confident, Pat. Absolutely. I, 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 have, I have yet to see Ryan Taylor not in a confident frame of mind, particularly at the top of any matchup. That's right. It was in this very building, Halloween night 2009, when he won the championship in Polo. Two months later, he would go on to defend maybe three. I don't know. It was later on that he would go on to defend this title against Exile in this very building. This is the hit. Second defense of the Cleaver National Guard Armory. Ryan Taylor looking very strong, very confident tonight. Hoping to do general manager, full-time general.
General Manager JT Allen and the Faction Proud. Jackson's coming. Oh no, is he really is he willing to get himself hurt too? Really? I don't think anyone wants to referee this match. Now with gentleman George Michael. Now with gentleman George Michael as a factor. A little senior official smiling Dave Jackson. He's he's reporting for duty. Uh-oh. Oh no, he's doing it to Smalling Dave Jackson too. He's two for two. Gentleman George Michael has thrown both referees out of the ring. Who's going to step up? Who's left? Gentleman George can be a referee. He's general manager. He can make Uh oh, wait a minute. That's oh. Jeff Manning. Well, the cavalry has arrived. whoop a doo I don't think Gentleman George sees him. Oh, oh. Oh, the stern father figure. Finally. Wow. That is a strong order by Jeff Manning. final referee for this matchup. He issued part of the sternest one I've ever heard. I've always heard him say he's going to fine Gentleman George or suspend Gentleman George, but I've never heard him say he was going to fire him. Well, we had to put our heads together and do something this evening after Gentleman George comes out with his legal document saying that he is the temporary general manager of the West Coast Wrestling Convention. So you had a hand in this, Mr. Kelly? I absolutely did. I just couldn't stand by and watch... Now we are joined. Well, joining us at ringside is gentleman George Michael. Our commentary team could very well become a foursome tonight. <laughs> 